Alright, yes, I'm Roman, and here we are again in the United States, and this time we will try Guyanese food. And here, this dish is called egg balls. So it's made of cassava with um, eggs inside, and you get different types of sauces which you can use. Alright, so the texture feels pretty soft. Alright, let's go. Oh, the pepper. Mm. No, in a pepper bite, just let me taste the pepper. Alright, it has a soft texture which is pretty good. I give it 8 out of 10. Number 2, tennis roll and cheese, which is a type of Guyanese bread and cheese. They normally use it for breakfast. That they normally eat for breakfast. Alright, so it has a, it's extra a, it's a sort of lemon taste with oh that is it. I've never had cheese like this. Oh, that, that's that's very good. This is something I would definitely eat in the morning. You can put some egg in it. Yeah. Or have some protein so and this is a traditional guava tart which is made with flour and guava. Yeah. Alright. It's a guava patty like. Right, let's see inside. It breaks apart so easily. Easily digestible. Oh it's got a very strong guava taste. It, this, this I give nine. It, it's That's it's sweet. nice, yeah. Mm. <laughs> this now is pine, pine, ah, pine tart. Okay. Yes. You can see the shape. This is good, but I prefer the guava because it's smooth. The guava one is here. Yeah. This one more chunky. Yeah, this is so much chunkier and it's it's good. Alright, I'm gonna say seven, go over nine. Big difference. And we have one more thing left, which is the I'm a big fan of carrot cake. I've never tasted taste a bad carrot cake before. I've never tasted a bad carrot cake before. And today will not be that day. Slightly dry. But if you're drinking, eating this with, and drinking milk or some juice, it would go well, you know? This could be a little bit moisture. And this is salara or red cake. Super soft. Sweet. Ah, 9.5. <laughs> and the last thing left to try will be the types of um, Guyanese yeah, drinks. The first one you'll try is a Guyanese cherry juice. <laughs> Typical cherry juice. I don't know if it's if there's anything distinctly Guyanese about it, but it's, it's good cherry juice. But the one that's most important for me will be this one. Mabi. Mabi, and it's made out of bark. It's a bark, a tree bark. Out of a tree bark. Now, when drinking it, it's like a sort of tea, a cold tea. Initially, a very sweet taste, and then, like, yeah, when it gets here, it starts to taste a little bit bitter. We did a video once with um, Guyanese food, and this is just as an addition. <laughs> so, this is called Bake with Sawfish. Are they, I just like bit into it, but it's fine. <laughs> mm. oh, mm. Compared to the spice, we love the spice. Mm. The spice. Oh, I tell you, I love the spice. Side. Yeah. I like it. For me, it's it's great for breakfast with tea, maybe lunch if you're feeling needy. But all in all, I think Guyanese food is very much similar to Jamaican or Caribbean food, and there are so many other things that I would love to try if I get a chance. I'll see if I can try them, but overall, if I have to give an overall score, I'd say 8.5. Anyway, that's it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share it. If you're a guy, please let me know in the comments down below, and I'll see you next time. Ciao, ciao.